This is DragonBlogger here to show you how to use the Windows MS Config utility to clean up your start programs. That way you can make your Windows operating system run faster and load to your desktop faster when you first start up Windows. Windows versions like Vista XP and Windows 7 all come with the MS Config utility which is a powerful utility that lets you edit some of the processes uh, in your underlying Windows operating system. You want to click on your Windows Start button then type MS config in your search bar right click on MS config and you have to run it as administrator and grant permission to run as administrator once your MS config loads you're gonna to wanna to click on the startup tab to see all programs that are in your Windows start menu and that and your registry that start when you start up Windows here you will see the item name in the left column the manufacturer as detailed in the process or file and the command that actually runs. If you know what these programs are you'll know right away whether or not you need them to start up a Windows startup like for instance uh, Microsoft IntelliType Pro is for a Microsoft keyboard Logitech Setpoint is for my mouse Microsoft Security Essentials is my antivirus program FCleaner is a, a program that cleans out my Windows registry and I use for uninstalling programs etc. So if you know the program is one that you're going to keep, you don't need to remove it from your startup. However, not all programs need to start up to be effective. Antiviruses should always start up when Windows starts up. Um, other programs such as Google, maybe Real Player is one that you don't need to start up uh, when Windows starts up because you just basically need it to run when you want to open up something uh, in Real Player. So you're going to want to uncheck Real Player, click on the Apply button, and that will remove it from your Windows startup. When you click OK and then reboot, then that program will no longer start when Windows starts. So the more programs you can clean up, the better, and the faster your Windows operating system will load, the less processes will be running in memory consuming RAM as well. Now if you see files you do not recognize, uh, kind of shady startup items, you can use a process, uh, website that I like called uh, processlibrary.com slash directory and do a search for a library or DLL or an EXE file that you might question like I'll you know just put in a common one like soundman.exe here and you'll see sound.dll, sound.exe, uh, soundman let's see and you'll see soundman turns a result tells you soundman is real tech advanced logic shows you that it's safe not a high security risk I've actually used processlibrary.com uh, to find and search for Windows processes as well that I didn't recognize to find out if they were suspicious or spyware or viruses so if you see any files or any programs in your Windows startup and you don't recognize them use process library or Google the process see what it is see if it's something that you might be alarmed about and should be disabled uh, in the meantime Use MS Config to manually clean up your startup programs. That way your Windows operating system starts faster and you have less processes and memory consuming RAM. So overall you should see a little improvement uh, in your Windows operating system performance depending on how many programs you clean up. Now I recommend cleaning up as many as possible. Remember the more you clean out the faster your Windows will be and will start up. Always leave your antivirus or anti-spyware starting when Windows starts up. You do need your antivirus to run right at the very beginning. Uh, other than that, you, all others are up to your own discretion. This is a Dragon Blogger video presentation. Thank you for watching.